we age, right? Uh, after Our 40, heart, we'll, we'll not be able, able to take it. We actually don't have as much fun like, all the time. I think everything that we do together is an adventure. So you are going to draw the heart and then I'm going to colour. Yeah. I have fill up the paint. Okay, okay, okay. I, 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 I have an idea, but I don't know how I'm going to execute it. What's that? The head is a bit too big, you follow this one. <laughs> oh my god, look like emo leh. <laughs> <laughs> what like that? <laughs> oh my god, are you drawing our future home? <laughs> my arm pain from all this swinging. Masterpiece. We have drawn a shape of a heart. With our name inside. Mm -hmm. To say that Habib Aisha forever. The sun. Uh, every time the sun rises, of course, uh, I wish to look at uh, this partner of mine. Lastly, she has drawn a rose. Uh, maybe she's hinting that I should get her a bouquet uh, for her birthday this week. So, uh, let's see. Oh, I love it. We coloured the whole two panels. Yeah, it started off with a dinosaur. Halfway through, I just decided it would look cute to have an emo mushroom. To match the prehistoric times, I drew another flying dinosaur. And that's a chicken fish. And then I wanted to draw mushrooms. Because I was inspired by the plain, the plain drip, you know. Good job, good job, good job. So these are our initials. And it's actually in the design that I came up with for my proposal ring. I drew Kobe. I drew a game controller because he loves games. This was actually because I was listening to a song before here and it was day and night and I was like, you know what it would be cool? To draw day and night? I was just letting my creative juices flow. Yeah, Good job. I can tell. Good job. Me? I say. You say this. We've got another set of questions to answer. Mm -hmm. So Aisha, what does adventure play mean to you? Adventure or play, it means uh, doing something fun and uh, something that gives me that adrenaline rush. The rush? Okay. Yes. Was it last year for my birthday? We went to commit suicide. It's a bungee jump. It's about 56 meters high if I, if I remember correctly. Yes, for, yeah. for your birthday, I decided to sacrifice my life by jumping down. Oh my god. Okay. So and sweet. it was me who did that first. Yeah, correct. I made the first move. Yeah. Not even you. Yeah, oh my god. So thank you so much. Uh, that was really fun uh, for us. Play, for me, it refers to being able to have fun without any worry, without any stress, without any danger. Playing game, I think that's play. Or if, let's say, we were to go out, we go to like Wawa Wet or we go to the zoo just for a date. I think that's play. But adventure is when you're not so comfortable doing it, but you know that it's fun. It can be a little bit risky. For example, if we were to go trekking, maybe traveling is an adventure. Playing is more of dating. To me, play is just having fun like any activity that is fun. So like us baking, cooking together, or like joking around. But adventure to me is also something bigger. Yeah, like opening your eyes to the world. When I see the word play, immediately I think of like fun and like yeah. games. I would associate adventure with like outdoorsy kind of things. Like these kind of like outdoorsy kind of activities. Lah. Something like exploring and stuff like that. I think if I were to zoom into adventure, I think a little bit more about travelling. Mm. Like going on an adventure to explore mm. different places that we've never been to. Yeah. Play for me, I think of people in a setting where, you know, we are with friends. Yeah, I mean, that, both, both that of us are the same thing. easily brings us a lot of fun. Yeah. What is the most fun we had in the last few years? We have done a few activities together. Like, mm. okay, we did the bungee jump last year and then we also went paragliding in Turkey. Mm. And then we tried to actually find for fun things, fun outdoor activities to do whenever we travel. Mm. So there are a lot of fun things that we have done together and I think we want to do more. I also heard an advice from our doctor. Uh, they say as we <laughs> age, right, uh, after oh, 40, <laughs> We'll we'll not be able, able to, to take, take it. it. So we try to <laughs> do all these fun activities before we turn 40. I want to say in Japan, when I go there and I did all sorts of, uh, I don't know, all the onsen, uh, food, uh, everything I try. The most fun I've had was also while travelling. I think like the most recent big trip was the, the UK one. Just walking around the city was an adventure, it was fun. Because it was a solo trip, so, so it was a big 
mouth for Very recently, our Korea trip. Mm. Yeah, like, I think it was a very good time for us just spend one on one time. That time together really um, reminded us of how much fun we have one on one. Yeah. Okay. Why are you not gonna say that, huh? Yeah. And no, like, uh. I would say, like, honestly, drinking with, like, Lukman and Rishi, they all. Okay. It's like, honestly, when we get together, we're a crazy bunch. Have it's not that we drink a lot, we actually drink very little. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We don't need alcohol yeah, even. Yeah, actually, yeah. yeah. We just go to someone's house and then we're chilling and then that's it. The, the night just becomes like mad. How do we have fun in our relationship? Uh, we pair up together. A good example of what we just did uh, yeah. moments ago. Yes. Uh, Something that we have been wanting to do. Okay, you do the drawing because you're good at art. I do the colouring because I'm good at colouring. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so this is yeah. how we... Complement each other. We complement. Yeah. We, we have this cooperation with, between each other. We are actually having fun already, but of course we would want to have more fun together. Right? Yeah. I think we have enough fun. Huh, like I mean, okay, we try new things. We find ways to do new things also. We try and find, we try and go to the whatever attraction that is not limited to just Singapore lah. Like recently the Thailand trip that we went. Yeah, so mm -hmm. that was fun also. I think for the amount of time that we have, we actually go out quite a bit and we do a lot of things. Both of us work a lot. Like we work a lot or we just have a lot of commitments to, so we actually don't have as much fun like all the time. It's like, no matter how tired we'll like try and go out. Actually even if we stay home we're so we cook. We're so cook. I feel it's like a work hard, play hard kind of thing. We already have enough fun in our lives. Yeah. That we have together with everybody around us. Yeah. That it's enough. La. I wouldn't say that we're boring people or we're a boring couple or anything. Like when we hang out one-on-one -on -one and everything also, we have fun. Because my love language is quality time, Quality time, time right? yeah, exactly. So, so being in your presence, just chit-chatting a little bit, like that is fun for me already. Mm. What other adventures do you want to do in the near future? Maybe I want to do something like water stuff, water like uh, kayaking, huh? river rafting. Something that I've been wanting to do is actually river rafting. Besides that, of course, I want to go on skydiving. Correct. Well. I actually wanted to say that for me because Initially, we wanted to go, but uh, we had Zara uh, with us already. Uh, we actually postponed it, but don't know until when. But I hope we will find the right time, the right place to actually do the skydiving yes. so that we can take on our bucket list. Yes, two more adventures together. Two. Uh, Buy a house with you. That's an adventure. Oh, it's a milestone. Renovation, you okay. design the house. It's an adventure you never do, as long as you never do before. That's true. In a lifetime, there yeah. are some stages that are all considered adventures. When you get promoted at work, when you, uh, I don't know, simple thing, when you earn your first 100k, all these things are all adventures. Uh. I want to travel with you, uh, go on more holidays. Individually, I want to get to know more people, explore uh, whatever life can offer. Uh. Maybe I'll meet someone who likes fishing. Mm. And maybe I will pick up fishing, fishing? as a temporary hobby. Yeah. So I learn something. Uh, I want to go like rock hounding one day in the future. Like I just like travel, then after that ask the locals, and then we go like dig for crystals. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah just, I want to travel more together. Of course. Yeah, although I'm very scared of the cold, I'm willing to compromise a little bit and try to go to a whole country. I really want to go to Spain actually. Spain? Yeah. Wow, I, you never said anything about this. Yeah, I don't think I've mentioned it. Yeah. yeah. You're going to need to learn a bit of Espanol. Hola. <laughs> that's, that's Spanish, right? I think so. <laughs> I wouldn't know. I think everything that we do together is an adventure. All these are new experiences that we're having. Yeah. Like the proposal, the wedding that we're planning for, yeah. um, the honeymoon that we're going to be doing eventually. Um, getting a house. I think all this is like an adventure in itself. Yeah. And like, I think it's gonna be a cool adventure to do with you. Alongside all our overseas trips as well. Yeah. I wanna go skydiving. Oh, have fun with that, sister. <laughs> we will go Dubai together. Yeah, we can go together, <laughs> but then you can do the, the, the diving. I'll look from the ground like, wow. <laughs>
Yo, Sorry, it's like there's quite a quick. second hit here. You did the jump Usually first. Usually, most of the activities, I'm the one who take boat first. Getting my clay business like back and rolling. 